my name is Will Carpenter and I'd like to welcome you to American Cool Television. Today's word's definition, a person who judges, evaluates, or analyzes. One synonym, reviewer, etymology, decide. And if you thought critic, why well, you'd be right. Well, who's the big critic on planet Earth? Well, I believe it's I. And there's two eyes right in here, so let's get it right between the two eyes. Start off with talking about what we know, and we know critical, and that's the AL, and of course there's the famous word criticize. And this is kind of when you size up a situation, and then there's kind of a religious idea here. It's criticism. I state the matter of the critic, and another famous one is when we have the word critique. And when you have the word teak at the end, there's a connection with tech, and tech takes us to X. And as far as tech and a critic are concerned, there's five flavors a critic is conscious of. A critique is an art, a craft, skill, method, and system. So every critic who is critiquing needs to be concerned with those five ideas. So now let's open up this word, and we have right here, I characterize C right, and we could put an E up here and say they're talking about a rite of passage, but also it's talking about what is right. So every true critic has to go on a rite of passage to find out what is right, and then you tell everybody. And that's what a critic does. And now let's take a look at the word that's up here in etymology, and that is called decide. Okay? So this is the famous etymology word for critic, and this tells a great story. See these two D's, D E, D E? It's really of and of. So the critic is right in the middle, and this is CI, and that's the cutting eye. So the two sides are on each side of the cutting eye, which is the core eye and the central eye. And that is the key to true criticism, is you find the center of yourself, and then you can find the center of all things you want to criticize. And that is critic.